Hey Lobos, Ben Johnson here to show you how to do a real quick and simple Google Hangout or Google Meet. In the last video I showed you how to do a more complicated office hours. Maybe you just need to meet with one student or a few students or an, a co-worker. And so first step is to get logged into your Google Drive, drive.google.com. Make sure that you log in with your PSD credentials. You'll see your PSD logo in the upper right hand corner. Next to that you'll see this 3x3 three three waffle grid. Go ahead and click on the waffle and choose Google Meet. Scroll down if you're not seeing it. That'll take you to the Google Meet screen. Just make sure that you're logged in with your PSD credentials. And then you'll simply um, click Join a Meeting. You'll give it a name. So I'll just name it 3-24 Meeting. And then hit Continue. Okay, at this point you're the only one in the meeting. You'll just go ahead and hit join now. And uh, to get people to the meeting, the simplest way to do it is just to add people. And you can just type their um, PSD email address or whatever email address they're using. And that will just send them a quick invite that they can then click on and join the meeting. So that's the fastest way, as long as you know the student's um, PSD ID or the teacher's um, PSD uh, email. The um, the other way to do it is, let's see, the other way to do it is to go ahead and just click on this arrow next to the meeting name, and you can copy the the joining info, and you could just uh, post that in your Google Classroom or zip that out in an email through the PSD gradebook. So so those are the two ways to, to accomplish that. Um, if this meeting needs to be recorded, you'll come to the lower right hand side, click on these three dots, and you'll hit record meeting. Make sure that you tell everybody that you're recording the meeting. And then just in a second, um, you'll see this turn red, and that means that you're recording. And so everything that transpires here will be recorded. It will um, put a copy of the video into your Google Drive. Google makes a folder called Meet Recordings, and so you'll find that in the Meet Recordings folder. You also get an email with the finished video, and so you'll have access to that if you'd like. So at this point, you would just go ahead and have whatever conversation um, as people add. You'll see them show up here on the right. You can click on their picture to put them on the big screen. If you want to do a chat, um, students uh, can ask questions in the chat window and send those to you. One thing that you might do is um, have a PDF or a slideshow or even a whiteboard up that you want to share with the group. To do that you'll just hit this present now button and you could say your entire screen or you could just pick a window and um, I guess I don't have any other windows open that I want to show you at this point so let's just do that and I'll say um, the entire screen and so now at this point um, I would just hit hit share that screen and uh, maybe I would go to a whiteboard or something that I have open in another tab. Maybe I have a Google presentation, a PDF, a chart, uh, a map, a diagram. And um, at this point, uh, students are just going to see whatever you have up on your screen and this is being recorded as part of that presentation. So use that however you um, would like. And let's see, I'm going to go back to my Hangout. Once you're finished showing that presentation, then you can stop stop presenting. And that'll just go back to, to your camera so the students can see you. Um, anyway, you could go on and have that uh, meeting with, with uh, whoever you want. And then when you're finally finished, you'll hit the red phone at the bottom here. And that will stop your, your call. And um, what will happen in a few minutes, you'll get an email link. And let's see if I have one. 
it takes just a few minutes to get that but what will happen is uh, you'll get an email um, with a link to the video that's saved in your Google Drive that you can reference if you need to later on. So that's how you do a real quick simple um, Google Meet with, with a few students or with a few staff members. Um, otherwise uh, setting up office hours in your Google Classroom is an, another nice way to accomplish that and you can refer to my last video for that one.